Greetings ladies and gentlemen and welcome to another video. My name's Adam, this is AH on Two Wheels. Okay, today, I have just received this. Coso, which I presume is how it's pronounced, digital speedo for the Harley Sportster. It's not going to be an instruction video of how to install one of these, it's just going to be each stage and seeing how I get on and anything that I notice and then testing it. That's the good bit. So, see you on the next piece. As I said, I think it's pronounced Coso. This is the one for my Sportster. Nothing else in the box. Let's open it up and see what's inside. <laughs> First thing you see. Please read manual. Yeah, that goes against everything a 40 plus year old man ever does. But I might this time. So in the box, the gauge itself, instructions, and a couple of stickers. I have had a little look, I did, honest, and uh, I'm going to start taking my bike apart first. <laughs> So on my Sportster, in the custom, it has this like lower slung speedo, instead of being on a bracket up there. Well, a couple of screws under there I've got to get to. Let's give it a go. Okay, doesn't look like I needed to take the little rubber boot off there. I could have left that on. It's a separate part of the harness. So I will put that back on again. And then it's just one multi plug. Oops, you can't see there. One multi plug in the back. Right, Harley Speedo out. There's this rubber seal. The new one doesn't have, so I'll transfer that over. And then it really is just plug and play. Well, plug and hope we play. That has been super easy. In fact, so easy I am really worried because nothing goes that easy, does it? So I'm going to put the main fuse back in. Sorry, can't remember if I said you're going to work on the electrics, take the fuse out and uh, let's see what happens okay installed installation absolute dream really really easy uh, set up just reading the instructions pressing the button a lot and uh, I'm sure it can do things that my bike can't but uh, you know I don't have a fuel sender you know, so I don't get accurate fuel readings but I tend to go off my trip counter um, oh, apologies yeah, weeds and uh, here we go now currently odometer see that that's at zero uh, apparently after driving or riding a little bit it'll pick that up from the ECM and it'll display the correct mileage and uh, you can change the colours, you can change the brightness you've got your normal trip counters time, engine temp, voltage, gear indicator yeah, it's just different isn't it? So. Another little play. Okay. 
twofold little trip out. Testing out this new speedo. Quite like the green glow. That looks really cool. Waiting to make sure the odometer flashes across. And I'm also dropping off a, a card and a nice bottle of whiskey for my dad for Father's Day tomorrow. Is there a better use for one of these swing arm bags? For a bottle of Gentleman Jack. Okay, GoPro battery's died, so onto the phone now. Just a quick look at the colours. We've got green, blue, indigo, purple. White, I suppose. Red. Orange. Yellow. And back to green. No, I quite like the green. And the blue. I think I'm going to stick with the green for now. Can change the brightness as well, but I'll keep it nice and bright. Okay, as you can see, 25 miles in, still hasn't gone over, and uh, now my GoPro battery's died. So I am going to head back and hopefully it'll click over by the time I get to get back home. If not, I shall have another ride out, hopefully tomorrow morning. We shall see. Okay, so almost 60 miles since fitting this, uh, the new Speedo. Um, it, hasn't brought the 60 miles exactly now uh, it hasn't brought up the um, odometer reading from the ECM um, but I've spoken to the company I bought it from and yeah some bikes do some bikes don't this is one of the earlier ECM models so I'm presuming that could be the reason um, the is there, sorry, there is a, a section on it where you can manually input so there, the, the ECM still registers the bike's true mileage um, so this is a couple of miles out to be fair because I did guess, I did round it up but I hadn't made a, de a decent note of it before I took the old one out. So there is always that option to be able to put it in and uh, it's quite a good feature. Anyway, to round up, I really, really do like this speedo. Thank you very much for watching, if you've managed to get this far, uh, can you please give me a, a like and a subscribe and uh, I shall catch you next time. Thank you very much and bye for now.